so worried about it being on my arm. Why am I doing this? Ah! <laughs> what do you think? It'll probably go away. We're gone on a road trip. Road trip? And we're gonna end up in so many different places. It's gonna not make any sense, but we're going to a wedding and some other stuff. And first stop is Nebraska, baby. Nebraska. And we're gonna meet my friend Brooklyn, who I've never met in person, but I know her from Instagram and YouTube. So that's how you make friends, people. Let's go, Nebraska. Nebraska. We got some Arby's. Western chippy sandwich time. So this is how you make a Western chippy Sammy. If you're able to order buns in an Arby's, first off, that's the only way you can do this. You got your tomato sauce on the bottom. Oh no no, Arby's sauce. Oh my bad, Arby's sauce. Uh, don't get it twisted. And then away we go. That's how we do it. Mmm. Boba, do you want to put yours in? <laughs> nice. This oh, is sorry. Brooklyn. Hello. So yeah, this is Brooklyn. She loves stuff buns. She loves thrifting. She has cool hair and she has a YouTube channel. So you should go follow her and I'll link her below. This is Omaha. <laughs> So basically we were just exploring a lot of Omaha and honestly it was a lot better than I expected. Super artsy, super cool, lots of vintage thrift stores. There was this amazing candy store that had so much memorabilia in it. This is so cool. Did we get a pen? Yeah. Random stuff, but I loved it. There was like an Elvis, there was all these like arcade games, there was even Sully and Mike Wazowski, which is super cool. And then I found these really crazy bug candies. We went into this cool thrift store called Scout, which had amazing clothes. I didn't end up buying anything, but I have a whole thrift video that you can go watch in the description. And obviously we got lunch. The biggest, I could do weightlifting right now. Burrito. <laughs> there you go. I just like slaps all over you. Massive chips. What do you have? With a baby taco. Baby taco. Then at the end of the night, Brooklyn took us to this really cool bar that like feeds raccoons at the end of the night. They were super cute. The feeling is then we went back to her apartment, which is like the cutest thing I've ever seen. And she showed me a bunch of her Doc Martin collection. She's trying to sell a bunch of them and stuff. So I'll put her deeds below, but ah, oh, she had so many amazing docs. I showed you the same ones out there. Oh, and you can match. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Okay. I know okay. you don't like them at all, but okay. I they're way too big on me, so you should try them. Go with my... I have the craziest collection. I, I really do. Oh yeah. Tell people don't. And type like. Uh, We're matching. Dash it's like mine are the mini, <laughs> mini feet. So we tried on some cool dogs, and then we did something crazy. Maybe we're doing tattoos. You know. Learning. Maybe this is the first time. I don't know. Right? Which color? Or wait, here. it was that one, yeah. Because I like lighter, it could look cute. Like lighter than black is what I'm saying. Right, yeah, I agree. What's your studio name? The Shitty Studio? Or Clink. Oh yeah, I got my tattoos done at the Shitty Studio. So it actually took us a little while to work out the design. It wasn't just like a random thing we just picked out, but yeah, I've always wanted a little flower and some freckles, so that's what we went for. Those, I wonder if those are too big for you. I need to redo those too. I think I want the middle one to be the smallest. That's so cute. They're so cute. What do you think, cameraman? Who? I'm not here. Oh yeah. I like them. That one, don't look at the camera. If you could hear a voice in the air, I would say I like them. Yeah? So... That's cool, we rented out this professional set to film yeah. this tattoo design in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> you want to test it out mm -hmm. in a different spot? On like, the bottom of your on foot? On my foot or something? <gasps> Sorry, I feel like, oh, yeah. <laughs> okay, where? That's where I like clean. Oh wow, this shit just got me. <laughs> okay, this is fine, this is great. Ready, Brooklyn? Moment of truth. Just out and don't. Oh, oh, do you want to go back to the Yeah, do you want it up here? You can. You can, okay, where am I going? You can do something right here. here. It's probably like more painful there, actually. But I know, that's what I'm thinking. 
Like, we don't have any fat down here. Yeah, I know, right? but I'm like, I don't know. Yeah, just You've been turning your feet. Yeah, I've been turning my feet. I just want you to know I'm going to try my best, okay? I would never try and have something turn out bad. We get a skin detail. Is that hurting? Not really. What's gone in? Let's get tatted, bro. It does feel like a tattoo. I mean, I look pretty good. I practiced the line around here. How about you practice giving him a dot real quick and you can see just how hard it is. I bet it's fine. <laughs> yeah, try and do a flower do and see how you can control it. Can I just try and put it around this so that's your freckle? Yeah, do that. Stretch it out. I don't- I was- uh, no! <laughs> I was comfortable! <laughs> Alright, Brooklyn, you've done a tattoo on me? Uh, yeah. I mean, it was rough, it was my first time. I tried to be gentle. It's cute. It's a good one. It could be worse. It could be worse. Plus, colors are harder, I think, than Color? just black. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, like Over you're a pro, yeah. Yeah. You tattooed yourself, Franklin? Yeah, the ones I have. Oh, you done those all yourself? Yeah, yeah but with a stick and poke. Right, okay. I was saying she should, you should let her give you the dot. And she can see just <laughs> I like, love that, like, give me the dot. Yeah, I think Give me coronavirus that. while you're at it. No, I don't As long as... <laughs> I'll let you do it. That should be good. When you have it on the skin, do you think it's supposed to have the needle like I started, on the skin and then it digs in? I started above, but if you want to try it, I think it's going to hurt if you have it in him. You might have to get one. Okay, there it is. We got the dot. Yes! <laughs> High five! We got the dot! Are you trained? Just yeah, I'm trained. Side. That's a fucking dot if I've ever seen one. Don't let it hit He's just going for it. <laughs> do you need more ink? <laughs> Do you have to get ink every now and then? Yeah. Oh my god, I gotta go. <laughs> what do you think? It'll probably go away. <laughs> it does look like a black dot. It does. And it's just bleeding. How many more do you want? That's good for today. <laughs> <laughs> All he did was make you bleed. I know. So as you can see, we weren't clearly very good with the tattoo gun, so Brooklyn decided to do the stick and poke on my arm instead because she had done that before. But yeah, that was super fun. We have one tattoo. We have two. Alrighty, so if you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching and thanks Brooklyn for being an amazing host in Nebraska and I just want to preface this and say do not do this at home don't don't do that stuff we were just messing around we were randomly thrifting all day and then Brooklyn was kind of like hey I have a tattoo gun like let's try it out so that's what we did and yeah probably would not yeah don't do this kids or adults so <laughs> yeah but now I have two tattoos on my arm it was supposed to be three we ran out of time to do the third one, slash we didn't like the purple color. So now I have them on my arm. You probably, I don't know if you can see them here, but yeah, the quality is bad. <laughs> Not of the tattoo, of the video. My whole life I've had this random obsession with always drawing a, uh, a flower around all of my freckles. So I decided like, why don't I do that as a tattoo? It's pretty chill. It's not gonna like, I'm not gonna regret it for the rest of my life. So yeah, and Brooklyn did a good job once we did stick and poke. The one on my foot still looks okay, but it's kind of fading away. And yeah, I kind of gave Nick a tattoo. He gave me a tattoo. They are both dots. My dots basically came off like you can't really see it but they have faded away they kind of scabbed and came off so the application was not professional as i say we're not professional so it's literally the first time just trying out a tattoo gun just to see the experience but yeah it was kind of fun it's the things that you do while you're traveling around and as you might know i'm traveling around america i have been filming so much footage so get ready to see a lot more stuff and let me know what you want to see. Um, I might be meeting up with a few more YouTubers and stuff. So I'm super excited for that. But yeah, hope you enjoy this video. If you want to see more of Brooklyn, we filmed a video together, which is a thrift video, which was my last one. Or you can find her on her channel. Or if you want to see more of me, 
I have hundreds of videos, so watch those. But anyways, my name is Jen. If you haven't already, please subscribe. My Instagram's at in the wonder years. And if you want to keep up with me while I'm away, because I haven't been uploading as much, which I'm super sorry. Um, <laughs> just find me on Instagram because I'm maybe I upload more on there. So yeah, I hope you're having a great day. Also, look at my amazing nails. I'm not a nails girl, but I love them. Um, but anyway, love you all. Okay. Um, bye.